Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So today we've got a brand new update inside of Roblox Islands. And this update's kind of leading off from the update last week and added another tool. And this tool is the Crystalux Plow. I don't really know how to pronounce that. So let's just go over this tool. So this tool is mostly for farming. So you can actually plow larger plots a lot faster. So for example, this is my little area right here. And it is a 5 by 1 radius. And you can plow really super fast. So that is what it basically does is just makes it so you can actually plow a lot faster and let me actually show you where you can actually craft this. So if you head your way to the workbench you can actually just search plow and you can find the normal plow here but if you find the crystalline plow right here you need three crystalline 30 steel plates and 20 pine wood and you're probably curious on what crystalline is. Well if you go ahead and head to the desert island while I'm talking about this the desert island is actually going to be a new sort of hub. So now, this is going to be the second type of hub. More into that in the later on in this video. But there are two new NPCs here. There is the animals here. So there's probably going to be new animals we can buy here. So that's coming soon. But if you head over to the crop sky, you can actually buy seeds. And there's only one seed in here. And it's the crystalline ivy seed. And you can buy them for 3,500 coins each. And if you actually buy that, you can go back to your island and actually plant them at your island on just a plowed plot of land. And this is what they actually look like fully grown, what looks really cool. They are just like a normal crop, but they take, I think it's up to like 10 minutes to grow. I'm not 100% sure about that. You guys might have to do some testing on that. But if you go ahead and harvest it, you will get around like three or four crystalline and an extra seed. And you can get more seeds from actually harvesting them. And yeah, now we're going to go over what I said before with the Desert Island. Desert Island is getting a rework. So Desert Island is going to be this secondary hub including new mobs, new merchants, new farm animals, new crops, and much more. Currently, we've added two new merchants, what I've just told you before, and you can purchase the crystalline seeds from this NPC, and they are in the process of making new animals. So expect a lot of things to come to the desert. They have added a new thing in the animal workbench. If you head over to the animal workbench and scroll all the way down to the bottom, you can actually see there is a new industrial nest right here. So now we have some quality of life changes. So if you go ahead and head into settings, there is a new setting right here. Highlight enemies. If you click that, it will highlight any enemy or basically animal around you. So this is really handy if you want to try and find any animals would have gone missing. And another thing going on with animals, they have finally fixed the issue where they bug out all the time and they like flip out and bug everywhere. Like, so there's a new thing for published islands, what I'll get into a little later, but we have some bug fixes this week. So fixed rage bleed, not damaging mobs. Fixed animals jittering, what I was just talking about. Fixed hold seed placement for PC. Fixed block placement, not registering when looking into the void or building underneath you. And that is pretty much it. And then they did fix this later on where you can actually build up and it will not bug out anymore. Onion prices have risen from 30 to 37 and watermelon prices have dropped from 80 to 74. And Pharma Cletus has recently been whispering about Spanish prices. Alright, now let me go on what the published island feature was. So let me go ahead and join a random shop here and let me show you what this feature actually is. It kind of looks like it's broken right now, but usually you will see like a little image up here saying who's the owner of the island and so on and so forth and just the island name. But yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Yeah, let me know on what you guys think of this update down in the comments and I'll see you next video or live stream YouTube and now goodbye YouTube.